You know, I was, e I was eager. I was uh, eager to get back on the court. Um, something unfortunate to happen with, with, with that little injury, uh, but I'm glad I'm, I'm healthy again. And, uh, and that's it. You know, it's just, it just sucks that we, we weren't able to get a win. And, and you know, I feel like if I, if I if, if I played just a little bit better, we would have won the game. You know, so. Um, this, this this loss is is, is on uh, is, is on me, and that's how I feel. And, and you know, I just all, uh, I just have to play better for my for my team, for my guys, for my for my coaches. So, and I know it's my first game back and all that, but but I always have you know high expectations for myself, and you know, I'm just disappointed that I wasn't able to fall better. And obviously, you know, it looks it doesn't look that good for for Dwight, so we're keeping him in, in you know. In our prayers and, and hopefully you know he can he can recover soon. Did you feel just out of rhythm and then you know physically how do you, how do you feel? No, really. I actually felt pretty good. My, my, you know I've been shooting a lot these days and leading up to the game and felt pretty good. Um, just kind of a little bit like especially at the end when I had those open threes, just a little more legs like it was just so flat. You know some of those shots, but maybe like early in the game a little bit too like anxious too. To shoot it and to make it, and but it felt good. Everything felt good. Well, I wasn't I, I, like other games. I felt more like more anxious to do stuff. And today I was, I was, you know, felt pretty good out there. Just wasn't falling. I didn't, but I, I didn't really overreact. You know, I just kept playing, uh, kept shooting. Felt like, oh, the next shit's going in. That was my mindset the whole night. Next, next one's going in for sure. I'm four for seventeen. Coach takes me out. I'm like, damn, I would have made the next shot for sure. And you know that's just kind of how my how my mind works, and and I'm gonna keep that mindset. You know, I'm gonna keep shooting in practice and I'm working on my shooting, and I, and I know sooner or later I'll, I'll be hitting those shots. Kepi, you've went through a long recovery before. Dwight's recovery would probably be pretty long. What what advice would you give to him on the mental aspect of it? Yeah. Uh, just take it day at a time, you know. Make make every day a little bit of progress. You know, don't don't get stuck at any point. Don't get like discouraged. Uh, I think I think Dwight has a really good mindset, a really you know strong mindset, and, and he's he's gonna be fine throughout the rehab if you know if, if we get the worst news. You know. So um, um, he he he, he uh, you know he he'll, he'll be around. I'm sure he's he's been great for the locker room. And great for you know for the culture that we're trying to build, and and he has a strong mindset, and you know that's why we love him so much. Hey there, NBA fans! For exclusive NBA content, subscribe to Fanatics View YouTube down below.